Now, we've got some big news for fans of Coronation Street. Andy Wyman, who plays Kirk, has an announcement for us in just a moment. But first, though, let's look back. Would you believe 20 years of our Kirky? Don't believe me, just watch. The name's Sutherland. Kirk Sutherland. License to kill. Well, you've got to play the field, haven't you? I don't think you'll ever get rid of this one. Mm. Hello, Weatherfield! He's good to be back! Kirkina Sutherland, I'm a lady. It <laughs> cost me a fortune, that ring. Well, how did I know you put it in a flaming kebab? I've got it! Yes! <laughs> You'll be out of my system and I'll feel nice Like after a vindaloo with too much spice <laughs> That's show business. He's so lovely. Andy joins me now. Andy, it's great to see you. And we, we just look at him there. And of course, known for, his, known for his comedy mainly, but you have had some sad news too over the years. Yeah, I have. I mean, there's been a lot of sad things over the years for me, but mainly comedy. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm more of a comedy actor. <laughs> I can do the serious stuff every now and again, but I prefer to stick to the comedy. Oh, listen, it's what we need right now, my love. It really is exactly what we need. How much of Kirky is like you, do you think? Are you anything yeah. like him? I'd like to say I'm as, I'm as lovable as Kirky. I yeah. mean, I'm, 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 I'm quite... I'm quite I like to think of, think of myself as a nice guy. I mean, obviously, when I was in the jungle, people seen me for, for the person that I am rather than this character that I played for 20 years. I mean, I love playing Kirk. He's a fantastic character to play in. Like I, said, I wouldn't like to say I'm as thick as him, but uh, I'm not... <laughs> I like to think of as lovable as what Kirk is. Lovable is a very, very good way to sum him up. And you mentioned the jungle there, because, of course, in a way, you experienced a little bit of what lockdown would be like when you were out there. Um, how has it been for you now? How, how are you doing? We've, we've been fine. I mean, I've been doing a, I've been doing a daily post on my me, on me Instagram. We've been doing a lot of TikToks. <laughs> yeah. I, got bullied in, I, got, I got bullied into the first one, but then uh, and I quite enjoyed it, so I've done quite a few since. So... Uh, but yeah, we just I get a lot of time off anyway, to be honest with you, with, with my job. So being at home is, is great for me. But I mean, I think I think everybody's ready ready to get back to work now. It's gonna it's gonna be different, but I think we're all ready to get back now and uh, get back to shooting the show again. No, exactly, and that is what has happened because just this morning we're now told that things will be picking up. You will be able to go back to work. Is that right? Yeah, uh, I think we're going to be going back on the 9th, uh, a week tomorrow, wow. um, which is fantastic news. Um, I think, like you say, I mean, I think I, I've had 10 weeks off now, which I mean, I, you do sometimes have periods where I have like six weeks off, but at least, you know, when you're going back and what yeah. you're going back to, but to know that we're going back now and uh, like in a week's time, it's, it's great news for everyone because I mean, I think everyone at first was a bit worried that we might have to go off air, but thankfully we can go back and uh, we can get back to filming again. No, exactly. And we can't have you going off air. We can't have you running out of episodes of Coronation Street. That just would not be right. It just uh, would not at all in any way. Things will be very different, though, won't they, Andy? I mean, there'll be a lot of restrictions and, uh, and you'll have to observe social distancing and there, there won't be any naughty scenes or anything like that. We saw you getting, you know, a few kisses there. That, <laughs> that's not good. That's, that just won't happen, will it? Yeah, there's definitely going to be no, no kissing scenes, but it's going to be kind of weird because even like if, if, I, if Kirk's walking down the street with Beth, We'd like link each other or, yeah. or hold hands, but there's going to be none of that now. So it's going to be different. I mean, we have to have an induction before we go back filming, uh, just to see what, what the new what the new system's going to be like. I mean, I think there's a one way system, and I think each director is just going to stay in one studio and stuff like that. So yeah. it's going to, it's going to take some getting used to. I'm sure once we get back filming, we will we'll soon get used to it. And uh, yeah. I think I think we just want to get back. Once we're back, we'll just crack on with it then. And, well, I say we'll soon get used to it. No, you will, of course you will. And, and the street will reflect what's going on in the world. I mean, people will have to be in Coronation Street. They will be social isolating anyway, you know, so that they'll have to reflect that. So that will be weaved yeah. in. And, and the, the writers are always so good at, at reflecting what's going on with their lives anyway. So it'll be really interesting. What an interesting and fascinating time to be working in the sort of job that you do. Can you remember your first ever scene? Was it, was it you and Maria, I think, was yeah, your first it was it was me, Maria, uh, Tyrone, Jack and Verus. It was actually uh, Tyrone and Marie's engagement party. Oh, gosh, I'd forgotten um, that. I'd forgotten they were so, engaged. Yeah, so that, that, was, that, was, that was the first scene. As Kirk was in the year before, playing a different character, Wayne, in, in the cabin, but that was the first episode as Kirk. But it was kind of nice because I've, I've, known, I've known Alan and Samuel about, well, by that time, I'd probably known about 15 years. So and we know, we've all known each other a very long time. So that kind of took 
took the, that took the pressure off a little bit. I mean, growing up for me, Coronation Street, Jack and Vera were my favourite characters. So oh, to be the first, the first proper scene as Kirk and Jack and Vera being in it was uh, was great. But like I say, because uh, Owen and Sammy was in the scene, obviously Tyrone and Marie, it kind of took the pressure off a little bit because I knew someone in there. Yeah, so. that's always that's yeah. always nice. Because any first day at any new job is is really hard. But I mean, to, to be in the Rovers with those well, all those legends, it's like, oh, a bit scary. Yeah, well, it, it was in the Douglas house. So um, yeah, oh. so it's going, going such an iconic set like that. On your yeah. first day playing a character was uh, was amazing, really. But yeah, just knowing don't knowing that knowing, knowing Alan and Samuel yeah. did take did take the edge off it, and I was able to go in and just uh, just just get on with it and enjoy it. Well, look, you do enjoy what you do, and we enjoy watching you. We really do. He's adorable. Sometimes he's daft, but that's all right. It's, it's, it's endearing. He's lovely. He's a lovely, lovely chap, and he always he means well. He always means he well, does. and he's kind. And that's He's got a heart of gold as Kirk. He has got an absolute heart of gold, as have you. Listen, thank you for joining us. Keep doing your TikToks. I know people got a bit confused with the men in black one and they thought that was your son, but it was your... Actually, she was yeah. so good at being a men in black <laughs> that yeah, people thought she was awesome. a wee boy. There she is, look! Yeah. Brilliant yeah. stuff. What moves? What moves? Yeah. She, she's done loads of them with us now. She enjoys them. It's great fun. Oh, thank you, love. It's great to talk to you, Andy. Give great, everybody thank you a... For you. Take care. Enjoy getting back to work next week and I know that you'll we'll all be very careful. Wait. Thank you, my love. See you later. Take care. Thank bye you. Bye. What a lovely guy. And Coronation Street, of course, continues tonight at half past seven on ITV.